There is an update from the southern part of the Philippines tonight about an abducted Vermont man. Local authorities in that area say they've arrested three suspects for kidnapping 26 year old Elliot Eastman of Heinsburg two weeks ago. ABC 22's Mike Hoey has been following this story for us and he joins us now live from the newsroom. Mike. Well, Lauren, police believe Elliot Eastman is still alive. They have not found him just yet, but there is a reward being offered for his safe recovery. I'll have more about that in a few moments. Before I get to that, though, the Philippine National Police say two of the men who kidnapped Eastman surrendered to them separately last night, both of whom reportedly pointed the finger at a third man who's also now in custody. And investigators add they've identified three other suspects as well whom they believe are holding Eastman at the moment. All six of them are charged with kidnapping. None of their names are available at this point, though, nor are the names of an unknown number of suspects whom police say they've charged as accessories in this case. And now let's get to the reward I mentioned for Eastman's safe recovery. It's 500,000 Philippine pesos, according to the Manila Bulletin, an English language newspaper in that nation's capital. That sum comes out to about 8,500 US dollars. And for some context here, investigators say four men dressed in black, armed with M16 rifles, showed up at Eastman's home two Thursdays ago in the town of Sabuco, claiming to be police. They reportedly shot him in the leg when he tried to escape, dragged him into a speedboat, and headed south. Live in the newsroom tonight, Mike Hoey, ABC 22 News.